Hey guys, it's your girl Vanessa here. Welcome back to another video. Today's video is this amazing high growth spray that you can use to grow your hair and also reduce shedding. I do hope that you keep on watching and you watch till the end of the video so you don't miss out on any useful information. Now let's hop right into the video. We are going to start by putting a little pan on the stove and add some water. I'm using about a glass of water here. Um, but you can use more if you want to guys then I will be going in with about a tablespoon of cloves now cloves do help with hair growth because it improves the blood flow to the scalp it helps you to get thicker hair and it also does help in reducing uh, shedding and hair loss so I'm going to bring that to the boil for about two minutes then I will be going in with some green tea now green tea is really good for hair because it prevents hair loss by inhibiting the activity or hormones that induce hair loss it also promotes hair regrowth by stimulating the hair follicles so really good to have in your regimen so i added a tea bag of that now i'm going to bring this to boil for another about 10 minutes now i also noticed that my um the water was reducing in quantity so i added another cup of water and then just allow it to boil guys for about 10 minutes now you know this is done when your cloves have almost sort of doubled in size and you can also see that the, um, the, the juice or like the liquid from this has darkened in colour. So that's how you know this is pretty much uh, done. So after that turn off your stove and allow it to cool down and then we're going to go ahead and strain it. Now to sieve this guys, I'm using my regular sieve, this is what I normally have in my house um, but use any other thing that you may have available to um, strain your DIYs. Now I found that the sieve didn't really do too much of a good job because I still had some debris left in this so that's why I'm using these paper towels um, so I can get rid of all the debris that I have. So if you notice the bottom of my bowl you can see that there are some debris in that so I don't want to get this in my hair so that's why I'm using this so I can get everything out. Now you can use a coffee filter as well if you want to. Now after doing that guys, this is what my paper towel looks like. So you can see it's pretty much dirty. So we got rid of all of the, um, the debris that was left in it. Now I'm going in here with some essential oils. Now I use the peppermint and tea tree essential oils. And these are really, really beneficial for high growth. Now essential oils also help with increasing the blood flow to the scalp, which can help you get thicker hair and also help you regrow hair in areas that you've probably lost hair from. So I'm adding about three drops of essential oils uh, to this. Um, you don't have to use the same one guys, you can use lavender or rosemary as well if you've got that. So stir that in and that's pretty much it. So your spray is pretty much ready. So I'm just going to transfer this to this spray bottle so that I can um, use it. Now I'm using a funnel to do this so that I don't make a mess um, essentially. Okay guys, so it's nice and ready. You can use it straight away or you can keep it in your fridge for up to three weeks. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Now in this next part of the video, I'm going to show you how to use it. So I'll suggest that you keep on watching. So I'm starting here on pretty much clean hair. Uh, but my hair does need a bit of moisture. Now there's so many ways that you can use this spray guys. You can use it as an overnight spray. 
uh, which you can just play in your hair and then wash out in the morning you can use it um, perhaps and just play in your hair leave it for a couple of hours and shampoo your hair so i would normally do it on my wash day um or you can use it as a leave-in spray just like i will be using in this part of the video so my hair is already in section so i'm just kind of undoing every single section of my hair that i already have and i'm going to work the spray through to my roots um spray that there and then massage it's always important that you massage your scalp guys it just helps with increasing the blood flow which can help you get thicker hair and also um, grow your hair a bit faster so it's always better that you massage your scalp so i'm just going to spray that to my roots guys but also spray to the rest of my hair so that includes my ends as well making sure that i massage that in nicely just so that you know my hair actually absorbs it Now, because I'm using this as a leave-in spray, I'm also going to be using an oil just to help seal the moisture in my hair. So, I'm using my aloe vera oil that I recently made for you guys. I will link it in my description box in case you haven't seen that video. So, I'm just going to put the oil again on my scalp and then the rest of my hair, making sure that, you know, everything is nice and covered. Then, I'm just going to go ahead and twist. Now, as you notice, guys, I'm not using a comb to detangle my hair here because i already detangled my hair i tend to properly detangle my hair once in a month and um, the rest of the time i will just finger detangle and get rid of the shed hair as i go along but i will not be using an actual comb or a brush to properly detangle because i normally do that on my wash day anyways so i'm just going to twist that part and then move on to the next and repeat until the rest of my hair is completely done I know some of you guys will probably wonder how often you should be using this. I would say twice a week is quite a good time frame to use this guys. But again you can use it for um, I mean, more than that if you want to or less. It really depends on your regimen but I would definitely recommend using it twice a week. Now the reason why that is is because our hair naturally thrives in moisture. Now if your hair is constantly dry it is going to break. Um, so you want to make sure that it stays as moisturized as it can possibly be to maximize your chances of seeing length over time. Now, not only this spray will give you moisture, it will also help to stimulate your follicles to provide uh, faster hair growth. And also it will help you guys reduce excessive shedding um, because of the green tea in it. So you want to use it as often as you can. Now, if you want to use it as a leave-in conditioner, it's perfectly fine oh sorry a leaving spray it's perfectly fine to use it twice a week but if you are to use it perhaps and shampoo your hair afterwards i would suggest maybe once every two weeks um because you don't really want to be shampooing your hair every single week because essentially that would just dry your hair out and cause more breakage than necessary really now in case you've been watching guys and you still haven't thumbs up the video please go ahead and give me a thumbs up also subscribe to the channel guys if you're not already i would really really appreciate it also share this video with somebody that you know could benefit from it could be your friend your family or somebody that you think will benefit from today's video pretty much now i'm not going to show you guys how i do the rest of my hair because the video will be otherwise really long so i'm just showing you guys just this part i went ahead and did this throughout the rest of my hair until the whole thing was completely done so this is pretty much it for me today guys thank you so much for watching i really appreciate it if you made it to the end of the video 
and i will catch you guys in my next video which will be very soon i just thought i'll show you guys what these look like like look at how moisturized that's looking and really shiny as well so you, i hope that you do try this out and if you do let me know what your experience is if you have any questions leave in the comment section down below and i'll catch you next time bye